are checking out. We were checking out today. Mm. Going to Bengaluru. Last coffee, last coffee. Enjoying the view and you can see that it's very clear. Beautiful. But Shiva is missing the fog here. Mm. Charan is enjoying Shiva, his bread Shiva. pakoda. <laughs> but yeah, it's very clear. Nice. This view we didn't get last two days. I think all these days it was like that. And on this side, it was like that. See those clouds. Nine o'clock. Just five hours late. <laughs> she was aim, and even actually we we thought we'll start by four a.m. in the morning. Just nine a.m. Just five hours late. <laughs> But that's okay. We at least had good night sleep, and yeah, today we're gonna hit to Bengaluru. That should take us exactly to our hotel. Two hundred and seventy-two kilometers, six hours, fifty minutes. Uh, we have to quickly leave because slowly this is gonna keep increasing. Almost seven hours. We have to bypass Mysore and go towards the right and reach Bengaluru. Only thing is, if we go in the P car, <laughs> you know Bengaluru, right? Little bit of off-road to get out of this hotel, Sinclair Retreat. Pricing, I think, because it was New Year, it was proper holiday season when we booked it. I think it costed us a little bit expensive, but otherwise everything else was good. Hospitality was good. Only thing is, I don't think it's worth what we paid. It could be at least thirty, forty percent less. I don't know how much it costs in normal times, off-season times, but uh, during holiday season, it costed us a bomb, equivalent to something like Taj. <laughs> Location is uh, pretty good. It's really out of the city. If you walk through this road, you can get some nice views like this. So you will you will definitely enjoy evening and morning walks. We did a lot of evening walks. Like almost in the last two days, we walked for at least ten kilometers. That to uphill, downhill. For me, it was more for the ride and not to explore the place this time. I know there are more places you can explore, but you know, Uti is a place. Uti, Kodai Canal, all these places are not more about exploring. It's more about you know enjoying the scenic beauty. It's more about relaxation, taking a back seat, and enjoying the views more than anything else. But yeah, you can do some off-road exploration, all that. Only thing is, we don't know the exact spots here. There might be some places where you can go into the woods, and if you are perfect with your bike, if you are confident with your bike, you can definitely have fun. Right now, we are more of touring and not of adventure tourers. <laughs> We're not like off-roaders. Nine o'clock right now. Hopefully by three, we should check in into the hotel. Okay, quick ride update. We've done 33.9, oh, 34 kilometers exactly. One hour of a ride. We have a good range of 170 kilometers, but there is a small problem. <laughs> We should have this Shiva GS 1250. Me, there is no fuel. I mean, it is there. I think 30 kilometers left, and I'm not sure if we're gonna get a fuel station in the next 30 kilometers. No problem. We have a pipe. <laughs> we're planning to pull out some fuel from my bike in case we need it. For now, I'm expecting there should be a fuel bunk in the next. I'm not sure. I'm thinking because it's been almost like 20 kilometers since we've seen a single fuel bunk. But yeah, like I'll have, I'll have to be honest about this. Uh, seriously, I'm bored with <laughs> all these guards and all that. I don't know. I need to find something else now at this point of time in my life because you know, riding through highways and riding through these guards in the last five years, it's not very interesting anymore. Maybe I have to do like adventure touring from now, not these highways. I don't mind shipping my bike to places where I can find more adventures and learn how to master the GS more. I think that will that would be the next step. You know, like this, a small ride, thousand kilometers of ride are like pretty fine. Uh, one more ride I'm gonna do in uh, I think Jan ending or Feb first week. I'm planning. See, I'm not saying I'm hating it and all. I'm enjoying it right now. You see, I'm having good fun. Like turning the bike around the corners like this, definitely having fun. But I'm not getting that kick. It's not giving me any joy, to be honest. Basically, I'm in a comfort zone right now. And if you're in the comfort zone all the time, obviously life is boring. So you need to move out of your comfort zone. Whether it is biking like this, or whether it is your job, whether it is your business, you have to challenge yourself. Only then you, you will find a reason to. You know, push a reason to live. Otherwise, life is really, really boring. Let's find that soon. I don't know where did we stop. I'm not even sure if you're able to hear me. Also, I removed the GoPro because uh, becoming too heavy. And anyways, there is nothing much interesting to show on this highway. It's a normal two-lane highway, so 
yeah we're having trouble overtaking and all that but it is expected that's how it is gonna be you guys know that the pace from Uti to Bangalore or Bangalore to Uti it is gonna be quite slow our pace was somewhere around 45 kilometers per hour I think another 90 kilometers left to reach the hotel Charan please reduce the sound we'll get copyright what is this fellow doing he's the part of the accord need to know Good thing is in this hotel where we're staying, we can order food and the food comes directly to the room, not in room dining. We're talking about swiggy. Swiggy dining. Inka ondi, mana gulab jamun sa still pending. Starting with chow chow baat, two masala dosa, five gulab jamun. So one more thing, these people are making me eat dosa from morning yar. From morning nae, from three days I'm eating only dosa. I'm not having non-veg at all, no chicken, no mutton, nothing. Tomorrow also will make me have this. No, I know. I thought tonight I'll have some non-veg. I think chicken starter or something like that. No, these are the inside. I'm eating only vegetarian food. You see, there's sambar, sambar everywhere. Sambar. What is this? I know you took me to Tamil Nadu, but that is gulab jamun, I think. Whoa! Hey, gulab jamun on steroids, right? Hey. Did you get vaccination? Steroids, buddy. That's Hulk of gulab jamun. Ilanti aari chera. Ilanti aidu. We ordered five gulab jamuns. Sixra. And our faces are already looking like gulab jamuns. Oh, by the way, I did not give any ride update after that. You do ride update, then copy do. Yeah, actually, basic <laughs> idea. Coming from Uti to Bangalore is a pretty. Actually, we we felt a little bit tired today, right? Because of the sun. Boring. Thirty bike. degrees, and it was boring here. No, actually, ride was fun because I had a new bike. <laughs> that is a different thing. But generally, the road, looking at the same highway. It was a little bit boring. It seems Shiva enjoyed. He also he he felt bored. It seems. What is that? Gulab jamun. Whoa! You want na mukodan ka? Tindan ka? So I think this ride is more about eating only. Ronaldo is watching us. Hey, this was always the case with us. Ninety percent of the time when we ride, it's more about eating. Yeah, with Shiva I eat more. That's for sure. With Charan. Niche ni footer us into na food nendi. Ah yeah. Oh by the way, look at this watch room. Mm, I don't want to give you like a special room tour and all that, but I'll just show it to you. Huge. Shiva scale, you pick up, sir. This is Shiva, five foot ten. It's literally the size of a room. You can literally put a bed here and sleep. That's the shower area. Shower with sauna. Yes, that's a nice bathtub. Our bathtub has been full on <laughs> with nice deep house music. Shiva is spending. He jumped into the swimming pool. That too with temperature heated swimming, heated swimming pool. Jumping into the water feels amazing after a hectic ride. That too hot. This is the section again. Uh, the commode is inside the showcase, <laughs> and you can take a bath in the showcase. You have the king and queen section here. Noise, very noise. We paid no office section. Yeah, once again, Chota sa TV. This is still decent, 30 inch TV I think. Maybe 42 inch. Okay, let's taste the gulab jamun. Last gulab jamun of the trip. From tomorrow, please don't give me dosa seedless. I'll have my chicken from tomorrow, little bit at least. Oh, what's that? Another dinner, chicken. First time taste, chicken. Hmm, soft. This is how a gulab jamun should be. Hmm. Flop, kada? Mm hmm. Super it, ah. But it's got some essence. Essence, yada. It's got some elachi or something. Feels good, soft. What the? Ardhang kada dalu. Are we getting up early? Shiva, please don't wake me up early tomorrow, please. Yeah, it's Sunday, right? It's holiday snow, na ko. Thank you, right? Very beautiful place, but unfortunately, this is the best we can open. And also, you see that architecture. They try to make a design, but there's a lot of grill, which is blocking your view. But anyways, there's not like a crazy view outside. Just chota chota buildings, that's it. But yes, we can see UB City right there. And this window definitely needs a lot of cleaning. बहुत गंदा दिख रहा. Lot of marks on it. Red skeleton. This is not the quality we paid for. But what we have to appreciate, we have to appreciate the room is amazing. Very nice. Very huge room. Almost 700 plus square feet of a room. And especially when three of us are staying, we need this kind of a room. And especially when you have luggage like this. And it's welcome back to the channel, guys. What's up, guys? कैसे हो? Elano, I hope everyone is doing great. Today is going to be a very different day because we're planning to ride in the evening. We're going to start the ride in the evening. This is the first time. In my entire riding life, even in yours, we're gonna start a ride at maybe five o'clock or six o'clock in the evening. In case it crosses six, then maybe we'll have to extend. He was in the washroom. Me and Charan are planning to go have breakfast.
ओके दिस इज लिटरली माय वेरी बैड बट या लिटरली माय थर्ड और फोर्थ कॉफी ब्लैक कॉफी आई डोंट नीड इट मच बट वी आर नॉट डूइंग एनीथिंग एट ऑल जस्ट एडिटेड माय वीडियो वन रियली गुड थिंग अबाउट बीइंग इन अ मेट्रो सिटी इज दैट यू गेट गुड इंटरनेट गुड वाईफाई इट्स नॉट लाइक सुपर फास्ट बट आई थिंक आई एम गेटिंग समवेयर अराउंड टेन और फिफ्टीन एम पी एस इज प्रिटी गुड अपलोड स्पीड कंसिडरिंग आर इज नॉट अ फोर के वीडियो दट इज मेन रीजन आई डोंट डू फोर के बिकॉज वेन यू ट्रेवल यू नॉट श्योर अबाउट यूर अपलोड स्पीड अदरवाइज यू हैव टू डिले योर वीडियो अ लिटिल बट और हैव अ लॉट ऑफ पेशेंस टू अपलोड इट थ्रू आउट द नाइट We don't even have a hotel booking today. We might either extend it. Let's see. Abhi to time is around 12 o'clock. Already checkout time ho gaya, but we are asking for a little bit of an extension. Maybe till 3 o'clock. I'm not sure if they'll accept. If they extend good, otherwise we'll be kicked out of the hotel. <laughs> we'll ride back home. That's the plan. Okay, we decided to stay back. I mean, not completely, but we got an extension thanks to Rich Carlton. Thank you so much for letting us stay for extra three hours. We had to check out at twelve. We are staying till four o'clock, almost four hours extension. And the best part, I have to appreciate Ritz Carlton Bengaluru for this. They allow Swiggy up to the door. <laughs> They'll keep coming now, <laughs> multiple times because we keep ordering a lot. Uh, right now, time is one forty-five, almost two o'clock. Another two hours we have. Finish this lunch and get out. Anything else you want to add? Swiggy or Bengaluru? <laughs> <laughs> But oh yes, we are all addicted to this machine. If you get used to this machine, na, you will love it. Coffee machine by Nespresso. It seems this is around twenty thousand rupees on Amazon. We will get a share, and you can gift me one. You are a coffee lover. <laughs> I gave you a good friend. Did you ever find a friend like this in your life? See, I can't deny it. <laughs> By the way, Shiva finished a lot of uh, milk powders in this trip. I couldn't show you that because before I came into the room, they were finished. He enters the room, I check the room out. He checks out this machine here. <laughs> I'm in this pod here, and he finishes it. <laughs> so we are leaving now. Time is 3:45 p.m. in the evening. Realistically, I think by 5 o'clock we'll start the bikes. Hopefully, there shouldn't be much traffic because it's a Sunday. Maximum, it should take 30 to 40 minutes to cross the city traffic, and from there onwards, still Hyderabad, a key single lane, almost uh, sorry, four lane, but single straight stretch, and just one left towards our house. We are done. I think it should take us around seven to eight hours max. With breaks, maybe eight and a half hours. So we'll see you on the bike. Let's go. Let's hit it. Home. Ten hours, seven minutes, five eighty-eight kilometers, three twenty a.m. Let's hit it. Ah, uh, then let's exit the city. First time, just a uh, ten minutes late. We thought we'll start at five p.m. Now it's exactly five eleven. Ah, petrol up to the edge, kuna. Whoa, nice. <laughs> Mini Cooper. So officially, the first time we are starting the ride at this hour in our life. Okay, we are out of the city. So it's really beautiful to start the ride now. 26 degrees. There's not much traffic. As per Google, we should reach by 3 a.m. 3 3:15 a.m. And road is super amazing. Like 11 or 10 ka road hai pura. So I think we will finish the ride much before time. We'll be racing Google's time. Maybe max one or two breaks and then we should be good. Full tank. Two two zero two. And uh, in another 40 kilometers, we're gonna finish 6,000 mark on this bike on the Emperor. Now it shows 658 range, but as we go along, slowly it gets calculated properly and we get a proper count. I think it is gonna go till almost 700 kilometers. Let's see. Uh, we're not gonna stop for fuel anymore. You guys know that. I'll keep repeating that. Please bear with me. Of course, we spent so much of money for this tank. We have to boast about it. And just now, I wore my gloves because it is getting cold. It was 23 degrees, uh, and it actually feels much lesser, 20 degrees maybe. Though we have heated grips, you know, you get cold air over here. So though you feel warm over here, still you need protection over here. So the hand guards definitely help a little bit, but not completely. That is the reason we got extenders as well, hand guard extenders, which we didn't fit now. After we go back, we'll do that. So now highway pay. I think it's gonna be amazing fun riding the bike in the night. And Also, I put it at the top setting, the windshield. Yes, I did.
204 kilometers bro non stop towards 37 minutes of a ride and 16 minutes of a break a sudden subscriber meet up kind of a meet up here Anandapur is Chandra Dhoor 1 or 2 kilometers from Anandapur I met this lovely guys here Unfortunately can't spend a lot of time here I have to get back soon 7.58 We did pretty well Another 4 to 5 hours to Hyderabad The ride is going on pretty well Really really enjoying this ride Especially the BMW You are not at all getting tired At least me and Shiva on the GS uh, Definitely if you want to tour a lot uh, On good highways or even on bad highways uh, you have to go for an adventure tourer and especially the GS adventure. Oh yes, it's lovely. Like if I could do 100 kilometers non-stop on, uh, on the Tiger, I'm able to do more than 200 kilometers. That's like more than double of it without getting stressed. Yeah. We intentionally took a break. Otherwise, we didn't need a break till maybe another 100 kilometers, which is totaling up to 300 kilometers without a break. So yeah, amazing bike yeah. also right now. I'm using the gear water lights because we don't have oncoming traffic and if I switch it off it's gonna be like this <laughs> literally dead my suggestion if you can afford it definitely go for a gear water lights really really having a lot of fun like next level truly next level fun on the GSA right now enjoying the ride properly today <laughs> compared to the rest of the days Last 80, 90 kilometers max to my house it is actually 110 kilometers. Your house is nearer than mine, lucky boy. My new house is nearer. Nearest is Iskagar. It's 70 kilometers. Tired? Fine? All good? Yeah, all good. All good. Ride is going pretty well. I think we finished the ride almost in 7 hours. One more hour left for me at least. So total 8 hours including breaks. We entered almost to Hyderabad and the tea tastes amazing. Finally, tea. Do you think you're a I'm a special It's last tie break. Best ride. Best ride, yeah. Well, coming back, best ride. In the last, maybe three, four rides. And we have entered. Hyderabad, Hamara Ghar, Hamara Home, Home Sweet Home. Six hours, four minutes of a ride, total ride time, and one hour, 30 minutes of a break time. The ride has been amazing, 542 kilometers. I hope uh, dogs don't follow me now and attack me. I can see one dog here. Please don't attack me. Hamara Gali ka kutta, but. Please understand and oh yes, see you know, Galika Kutta somehow they don't attack you. Ah, home sweet home. And let's park it here and I will see you right where we started. Emperor, thank you for taking me all over and getting me back. Chala then I hope you guys have enjoyed this vlog in case you did. You guys know what to do, hit the like button, do share, do comment, do subscribe. Do give extra likes for these lights. The clear water lights really really gave me so much of confidence in this ride. Hats off to you. So then I'll see you guys in the next vlog. Take care.